Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be doing this. Um, I guess it's kind of like a smoky, rosy, I want to say it's rose gold. Um, yeah, it's kind of rose gold, smoky eye. I'm actually like slightly obsessed, you know, slightly. Um, but yeah guys, if you want to see how to get this look, feel free and just keep on watching. So going straight into my Kylie Cosmetics sitting pretty palette going straight on into this colour here and just buffing it into like the outer V area and getting that nice and deep there and then I'm gonna go and buff that colour out with this kind of light sand shade and just kind of buff out the edges to make it nice and smooth. Then just going in with this shade here and just patting it and then blending it just to make it deep on the outer V there because I want all the drama to be based on that outer part of the eye. And as you can see, I am just spending a lot of time here blending, just making sure that I'm getting the kind of depth that I want out of the eye look. And again, just make sure to kind of blend out those edges so it doesn't look harsh and looks nice and blended and, you know, good. Then I'm just going to get some concealer here and do myself a half cut crease, you know. Um, but yeah, I'm just kind of showing you here how I like to do my cut crease. Pretty, pretty simple. Um, and then after going in with the concealer, I'm going to apply this shade these two shades here, mix them up kind of thing, make them have like a lovely rose gold baby, pack that on like the first half of the concealer and then once I've applied that I'm then going to go in with a different shade for the inner part of the corner here and I'll show you what colour I went in with which is this one here and just kind of giving it like a ombre effect but it looks like super cute. Then with this pink shade here and this brown shade, mixing them up together and just packing it on kind of where the shimmer shadow was, just so it's kind of effortlessly blended together, you know? And then here I just show you that I'm doing the exact same thing onto the other eye. Then, for some liner, I'm going to go in my Inglot liner here and this eyeliner will not budge, I shit you not, it just, it's impossible to get off, but like in a good way, so yeah, recommend this, and it's really easy to put on my eyeball, like, not gonna lie. Then I'm going to go in with this Urban Decay Midnight Cowboy Glitter and like just just pray for me right here. Do you see that face? <laughs> um, and just kind of going in where my cut crease kind of is and just kind of lining that over with the glitter. I just wanted a little, you know, little pop of glitter. I didn't want anything too much, but just something, you know. I should probably think of making this into a game every time I say kind of and, you know, take a shot, you know. Then just going in with some MAC mascara here and just, you know, putting them on my lashes. And then going in with my Pinky Go Arwa lashes, which I freaking love, and just applying them. Then, you know, you've got to have a good old dance while you're waiting for your other lash to dry. You know, I oh, want a little sing song apparently, yeah. Feeling myself. Um, and now that the other lash is, is, is dry, we can, we can put it on. Great. Great stuff. Um, but yeah, and then I'm going to move on with this Marc Jacobs primer here. It's like the coconut pri primer. And I'm just, you know, popping that on my face. Then here's me struggling to show you all three of the products I'm going to put on my face. So I'm going to use my Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk, my Hourglass and Alabaster and the Cover FX uh, Dew Drops. And then I'm going to contour with my LA Girl Pro Conceal and just showing you how I how I like to contour, you know. I like to look bronzy, especially, you know, I was feeling the glam today, so bronze, it, had to, it just had to be bronzy today. Then for concealer, I'm going to use my Tarte Shape Tape, and you know, pop it, you know, the eye bags, you know, the chin, nose, forehead, you, you get it, you get it. Then 
then as you can see just blending all that in make sure it looks you know all good then for powder I'm going to use my Laura Mercier obviously just to set all of that in place because I was feeling the glam you know I wanted it to basically not budge anywhere and not gonna lie I wore this to a night out and it did not go anywhere let me tell you oh you guys will have to tell me do you guys prefer it when I like do talk throughs or like when I when I talk and my mouth talks just, just wondering just wondering and um as you can see I'm just applying some powder um with a brush just to kind of set the cheeks and I'm using my Becca bronzer in sunrise waves and you know it's a super glowy bronzer so obviously putting it everywhere and yeah I'm just just dancing again great moves Lacey great moves I don't know about you guys, but whenever I'm getting ready to go out, I've got to listen to my music. Just letting you know. Um, and then to contour, um, I'm going to be using my ABH contour kit. Here it is. Here she is. And just, you know, struggle to open it. And contour, you know, the cheekbones, the nose, all the go-to places. Then for blush, I'm going to go in with this Wet n Wild blush here, it's called Apricot in the Middle and I just think it's such, like a pretty subtle blush and I'm just carving up those cheekbones because I want to look sculpted. Um, then finishing off the eyes, it looks really cringy but I'm like doing my waterline with some liner and then going back into that deep brown shade, buffing it out on the bottom lash line, mixing these two colours up again mixing them up, buffing them out, oh, and I'm singing again, well done, um, but yeah, just, you just keep going buffing, and, you know, a bit of black, a bit of smokiness, um, yeah, I, that's pretty much it, and then I'm using my MAC Nylon, um, just because it's, like, the best in a, in a highlight and brow highlight ever, so, and then, here you're gonna see me really struggle to put bottom lash mascara on, and then, to highlight, we are going to be using my Kylie Cosmetics Loose Highlighter in Santorini. Oh my gosh, I love this highlighter, and for a night out, it is the shit, basically. And then, for lips, I'm using my Kylie Cosmetics Lip Liner in Dolce K. Dolce K? Dolce K. Um, but yeah, just overline them a bit, and then this liquid lipstick in Libra. My go-to nude at the minute, it's such a pretty nude. Um, and then for gloss, I'm going to go in with, it, with So Cute, getting a bit tongue-tied there. Um, and then to set the face, just going in with my Morphe setting spray. And that's it. So guys, this is the finished look. I hope you all enjoyed watching this look. It was kind of just like a talk through. I just kind of wanted just to sit back and just concentrate on what I was doing. And I actually really enjoyed the look that I came out with today. Um, but yeah, if you really like this look, feel free to give it a thumbs up. Comment down below of what you think and if you're going to recreate this because I'd love to know. And feel free to give us a subscribe. It would mean a lot to me if you did. And feel free to follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is lacy.makeup. Up. so guys thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye see this is why i never wear nice tops when i'm filming because i've literally like i'm just covered in eyeshadow all over myself so it's probably for the best that i don't have nice clothes mm-hmm